Good morning, guys. Welcome to Monday morning. Last night, what did we do last night? Last night we had fun at the campsite. After we'd finished flying the kite, we then um, had a barbecue. We played badminton with the kids, which was really nice. Harry started to make a couple of friends, which is lovely to see. And I am now going to go for a walk. It's now Monday morning. I've just woken up. Excuse my appearance. I'm going for a quick run and then um, we're heading off to Folly Farm later on. So I best get cracking with this run, otherwise I will never get back. So I'll catch you in a bit after the run. So we're at Folly Farm this morning. They've got lots of social distancing paw prints on the floor. We have already got prepaid tickets. But this is the kind of prices we're expecting. We got our tickets through Tesco Flipkart. This is the map of Holly Farm. We've got barns and fairgrounds, and giraffe, and loads of. It's a bit more like a zoo than a farm. A big play area. Weather's not so fabulous this morning. Which way are we going? The zoo. Okay, we're going to the zoo bit. Weather is not so fabulous this morning. But we're hoping the sun is going to come out. So we are at the farm, like I said, um, the sun is trying to come out, it's just stopped raining, um, apparently we're heading away from everybody else, everyone else is going that way, we're heading this way, yep, I had a slight issue with cameras, I really don't have much luck, also I am not organised, seem to have misplaced the GoPro, brand new GoPro and I seem to have misplaced it. Had it on the beach with us last night filming. I'm hoping it's going to be in the tent somewhere. If not, oh well. So we are heading this way away from everybody else. Um, yeah, let's see what there is. Let's have some fun. Fucking tired this morning. Wow. Oh, it looks like castle. I assume it's a kids play area. I haven't got a map so they're doing really well in here for social distancing. They have got signs up everywhere. Maximum capacity in there is like 25 and then it's got keep two meters apart everywhere. That's a really cool castle though. <gasps> wow that ship looks awesome. I'm not sure the play areas are actually open or whether it's just a one-way thing, I don't know. Maybe they'll open up later in the day. But that is a cool play area. Nice picnic benches to have your lunch on later. Please don't feed the seagulls. is a cool ship and that's really good to know the play area is cleaned regularly this part of the park is really quiet because we've literally gone the opposite way to everybody else that slide's cool hand sanitizing stations everywhere i am very impressed with what i'm seeing so far whether everybody else has the same thing in, in mind is a different story. Ooh, let's see if we can see any lions. Coming up to the lion enclosure. Can you, what, can you see anything yet? No, I don't think, I, don't, I think they're all hiding. They're all hiding, are they? I don't, I don't think I could, I don't think I could read the facts about the lion. No, because that is all in Welsh. It says, it's the African lion. So they captured it from... So, uh, pause off, don't touch the glass. But... No? I don't see animatronics are working this morning. Animatronics? So, 
black and white roughed lemur. Can we see any lemurs? There they are. They're all a bit sleepy this morning. A African Avery, but that's the exit, so we need to go the other way. Where is it, Harry? On the roof? Yeah, I can see it on the roof. How's We're going to go in. There's a brown lemur over there. Where? On top. Over there in the far corner, you see the brown thing. Oh yeah, I can see it. Yeah. The enclosures look really cool. It's definitely a lot better than Blackpool Zoo than when we went there. Looking for a tapir. What can we see? Oh, hello. They're massive. Like They are but ugly. They're like. Don't be mean. Sorry, but they all are a bit weird. They look like hippos slash things. Yeah. <laughs> They're not attractive. Come on, guys. Look at that. Now it's all floppy and. I've never seen that animal before. I didn't even know these animals existed. It's got a massive enclosure, haven't they? Yeah, I don't need. Dad? Oh, 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 in the water, Go in the water. Bigger than Shamu Stadium, they. Shamu. That's a massive enclosure. Oh, it's going in. Walk out, see, going in. One, two, three. Oh, that's cool. Look at it, it wants a picture. <laughs> Look at is, it it a bit, is it a bit chilly? I think it's it is. Going. Oh. We've got poo splash. Excuse me. Oh, the ducks are going to see the poo. <laughs> you don't poo where you swim. <laughs> Who does that? Why are the ducks coming? <laughs> Maybe it's like, ooh, it's really cool. oh, 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 is that the toilet? Oh, nice. Seriously, why I wait today? <laughs> is that seriously why you went in there? Oh, wait, look at it. Ooh, there's no feet in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's the circle of life, Emily. <laughs> so just some tapia poo, poo for breakfast. Good morning, Meerkat. Hello, Mr. Meerkat. Oh, Harry, how cute is that? That's so really cute. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's not that. That's not that cute. Neil just looked up when we came to the window. Oh, Can we take one home? Oh, look. <laughs> Hello. 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 <laughs> How cute. Can we get it? Can we adopt it?
off into the African Avery. I am slightly scared about this. Try not to touch anything. Mummy, mummy, it just flew down. Oh it no. Down. That's a big one. Well, every time I've been in an Avery before, they're all tiny. Come on, open the door. I'm scared it's going to charge at us. I can't. Ah! Oh no, chicken! <laughs> Come on, Mr. Chicken. <laughs> oh my god. So there is the exit, and we've got to get past that. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Chicken. Should we do a daddy shot? Hello. No, not Oh. Oh. Sorry, wasn't getting too close. This is the scariest Avery I have been in. They're normally just really tiny birds. I was <laughs> getting chased by the chickens. <laughs> They're coming to get you. This one needs to look out for. Yeah, this one's a scary one. It almost attacked your mum. And here comes the rain. It's this one you need to look out for. Yeah, this one's a scary one. It almost attacked your mum. has found what he wants to find. Harry, what is it? Red panda. Because Harry absolutely loves pandas. Where's all your mates? Falls off all the windows. The seaweed is really lovely to see. It's so nice that they've even just tried all this all this theming up here of like fresh fruit carts and stuff. All the bamboo and the Chinese Asian feel. I mean they need to hide the speakers a bit better. They need to hide the speakers, but we'll let them off. It's just so nice to see that a UK zoo or a UK attraction is really trying like this. We've got two camels. I think that one's got the hump. <laughs> Don't look like they're talking to each other. Sorry, really rubbish jokes. to Florida mate but we're not allowed in. I know. We're not allowed in at the minute. There's no lions. There's Let's that. go and see what else there is. That's, That's a the scary one down there. Yeah. 
Don't wake sleeping lions, remember? Yeah. Well, look, if we can wake sleeping lions, I think we've already done that. Well, me. Hmm. Oh. What's that crazy granddad's in the that, um, that, that yeah. looks a bit lion enclosure? Yeah. Looks Looks like the lions have actually got a really massive enclosure out here. I just feel like they're just sitting inside today rather than being outside in the wet. You right? So like that, the lion's older than me. Is it? How old is His it? His name's Hugo and he's 16. He's 16? He's safari top before he came here. Oh wow. So that's the big lion that we saw, Hugo. He was born in 2008. Sex. Male. Does that mean F? Sex means whether it's a male or a female. Previous home. Nosley Safari Park. And then Longley Safari Park. He's moved around to you, girl, hasn't he? Yeah. And now he's up here in Wales. DNA. DNA. That's Welsh. It's cold, isn't it? It's got to be time for a coffee and a cake. There's a coffee shop here, so we've got lots of cakes. Got some salted caramel, chocolate orange, brownies, carrot cakes, apple and black carrot cake, obviously Welsh cakes, and a good selection of teas and coffees. Warming up with a brew. How much Much needed coffee. And some carrot cake. What cake have you got, Harry? What cake have you got? Chocolate fudge cake, is that yummy? And Dad's got a caramel slice. Sorry. Hyper zoomed in there. We're going to do some trading. That much, that's, the, that's a raw deal. What does that mean? Harry is trying to negotiate with David about slice, a slice of cake for a bit of cake. And I'm going to tuck into this one. Make it a bit smaller. Same size. So welcome to Farmer Glynn's Jolly Barn. I think this is probably one of the old attractions that they used to have from the original farming days. Obviously it's probably been done up a little bit in that time, but this is probably the original idea of this farm when it first started. You right? Look, this is the Jolly Farm. The Jolly, the jolly farm, farm, is it? The Jolly Barn. The Jolly Barn. Let's see what we've got over here. Owen and some blacksmith. Okay. Look at the beautiful sunset. Oh yeah. Oh, a ferret barn. So we've got some sheep. Oh, we've got some goats. And we've got some Baby goats. Love it. Oh, look at that one. I don't think you're supposed to sleep in there, mate. Lots of goats in here, all fast asleep. Having a lazy morning. <laughs> We have some for our Christmas dinner. Gobble, yep. mm. gobble, 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 gobble. We're getting nice and fat for Christmas dinner. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. We're trying to escape. Yeah. There's a hole there. Um, We're trying to pack his way out. Hello. Harry, 
what's in this one? Orbit. Meet Orbit. Orbit? Looks like Hedwig. Looks like, looks like who? Hedwig. Hedwig from Harry Potter. I want to see Achilles. Oh, Orbit and Achilles. Yeah. Look, look where Achilles is. Oh, he's in. Oh yeah, he's asleep. Is he sleeping? He's wondering what we're all doing looking at him. Hello. We're about to go on the land train and go to the piggery apparently. This is definitely a new experience. Let's see what we're doing and where we're going. Just following these guys. And so the train's every 20 minutes. God, it's smelly in there. It's nice to get out in the fresh air again. At least it's not raining now. I just feel very, very damp and wet. Having a great morning so far. My coffee has warmed me up a bit. That cake, carrot cake was delicious. Harry's having a great time, which is all that matters. So yeah, let's find out where we're going. Going in a tunnel. Woo so here is the land train entrance. A bit of a queue, but it looks like they're having to socially distance on the actual tractor ride, so every other bench has been left empty. He's not made it on the train. Oh, we're starting. Just about to go. Well, it, it's not really a train, it's a more. Well, a track. It's a tractor oh. train, isn't it? Yeah. Look at the goat standing up. Oh, yeah. It's in the alpacas. Yeah. And ready, steady. Ready, steady. Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the land train. My name is Amy, and I'll be your driver for today. If you can all give me a big wave, guys, if you can all hear me. That's perfect. Thank you, everyone. So just coming up on our right-hand side, you'll be able to see our four Shetland pony. So we've got three, oh, sorry, two in the first paddock there and two in the far paddock. And the one that is in the two in the first paddock there, the dark one that's a bit taller, train started raining again the train was really good um got to see lots of different paddocks lots of, i didn't know there were different types of sheep i learn something new every day um really good with the cleaning of this oh god i have to put the camera away really good with cleaning the tractor in between obviously the benches were kept separate for social distancing but it just takes a little bit longer but i think they've made the train ride shorter to cope with the capacity of that and they clean the trains in between so that's really good and there's lots of Alka gel stations as you're going past. So I think we're heading to the penguins. We're off to see the penguins. Welcome to Penguin Coast and Flamingo Lagoon. This looks cute. I do like seeing the penguins. Oh, oh that's so cute. Follow the penguin signs.
I love the fact that they were doing arrows for social distancing and they've got some theming involved. That's the way it should be. So we're gonna go see the penguins. So this is the problem where you're gonna have lots of people gathered together and you've got to rely on other people to keep away. Looks like it's feeding time. Always a bird in the penguin enclosure. Just love the way they walk. Oh, I think he's a really crazy one. My dinner, please. Do you like the penguins, Harry? Oh, a bit zoomed in on your nose. Like there. the penguin and the seagull. They're fighting, aren't they? Yeah, the penguin. The penguin's like, oi, give me the lounge. Get off my territory. This is where I live. I knew that. Get off our territory. That was my life. Yeah. Hello. Look at that fish. Can you see the fish? That's an impressive set of eyebrows. Yeah, right. Look at that one. He's just like. You want a bit of me, eh? Tough cookie, that one. Yeah. It's hard to stand like that for Look a while, isn't it? Look at that fish. I know, why is there a fish there? Why has nobody eaten it? I don't know. Look at them Look at them swimming, Mum. Look at them swimming. Ah, super cute. I'll see the penguins swimming under the water. Interesting fact about these penguins is apparently they like to live in their own poop. Look! What is it? Can we see any? Green is clean. Yeah, I saw one. Green is clean, apparently. Some fish on the floor. Look, the fish in the floor, the glass is rainbow. They're obviously. Uh, can't see any fish, any fish, any um, penguins swimming past. Look, penguin, penguin. Oh, there we are. That's a nice belly. That's a nice belly, isn't it? Just give it a good tickle. <laughs> I don't think they're very hungry though, are they? Oh, there's fish on the bottom. Look at that one. That one's doing. Maybe that's what he's doing. It's like a shark. It's like an upside down shark. So apparently the feathers are because it's molting season. So I've just been told by Emily and David, as the lady has said to them. And it's a normal thing for them to do. But I think there are far too many fish. They are so clearly not hungry. Mm. You can see how seals sneak up underneath and eat them. Yeah. My name is Mr. Look, this is really cool. You can figure out which penguin is which. So we have just seen which one? Mr. Whippy, which is this one. I want to find this one. Harry wants to find. Harry, so we need to look for orange and red, don't we? And there's the penguins we saw with the eyebrows. I think you know why this guy's called Feast. Why? Maybe maybe he eats all the fish. Maybe. Maybe that's the guy who swims down think, the hill. They're all ice creams, a magnum, a feast, a popsicle. And a Mr. Whippy. <laughs> Do we think we found Harry? Do we think it's... Where's my finger? Where's my finger? That one! Apparently sunbathing, because guess what guys? The sun's come out. We're leaving you in jail. Oh, skull and crossbones warning. Tropical trails. So we've got sloths, snakes, and crocodiles. Barbecued, three toed skin. Wednesday, custom of river bondsman. 
Fillet of rock python. Friday chicken. Real, really. Do you believe it? Yeah. So how many accidents? This duck has been accident free for one day. I see Nemo! Right in the corner up there. You see Nemo? I found him. Um, um, I found this, is a, cool. this is really cool. Look at these. It's like a sea anemone. Again, I really love water. What do you want to show me, Harry? Um, look in there. And by the way, can you see? A, I can see a crocodile. Oh, there's a lizard or a gecko or whatever it is. Um, I can see a crocodile. Can you? We're going to look at it in a minute then. farm harry's been to the shop of course everything ends with the shop and bought himself a red panda yeah. have you got a name yet ready ready mm. like ready brick ready like i think we'll work on that name a bit it was a really good day out i really enjoyed that the fa um the farm zoo is is really cool theming is great the variety of different um cafes it's not just one like we've got the coffee shop and there's there's loads. Obviously, we brought a picnic with us because we wanted to eat out for dinner tonight. Um, at the minute, they're taking part in the Eat Out to Help Out scheme. So our coffees were quite, um, yeah, pretty much half price, which was really cool. Um, great day. Fabulous day all round. All right, so that's it for Folly Farm. We're going out for dinner now. Catch you in a bit. for some dinner, lunch, brunch. Oh, I don't even know what it is. It's about half past four in the afternoon. Oh, sorry, excuse my finger. Hello, Biscuit. It's got a new name, it's called Biscuit. So we decided to come for some um, dinner. It's about half four in the afternoon. Um, yeah, we were all really hungry. We only had a really quite a light lunch. So this is the only time we could get in. This is where we've come for a nice lunch at a place called Harbour in Sandersfoot. Let me show you the menu. So this is the menu, it's Saunders at Harbour, it's bar and kitchen, so you've got different menus available. So these are available 12 to 4, sandwiches and jacket potatoes, a few small plates, some fish and grill, some classics, and some burgers, and we've got a kid's meal down here, all reasonably priced. It's really pretty in here. Really, really pretty in here. Is rendered. We've got a fish menu and they have a special board. It sounds really nice. And up here you get a lovely view from the harbour. So it's actually really nice here. Really looking forward to my dinner to come. I have ordered scampi and chips um, and 
Emily's ordered the peri peri chicken, which would be really nice. Can't wait. I'm so, so hungry. Oh, I've got two thoughts. Dinner has arrived. Mmm, tasty. Why? Good evening, guys. So we are back from Saunders Fort now. Um, we've been probably back about an hour. We've tidied the tent up. We've mucked for everything. We've decluttered. We've cleaned. Cause we've got another three nights in the tent. So yeah, we wanted to try and sort things out because that has been the worst thing. I think we should have got it all sorted the first night. Um, but it's just been a bit tricky. Um, Granddad got a bit tired, so he dropped him back off home. I'm not quite sure what we're doing for us the evening. Probably. It's now 10 to 8, so I'll probably end up staying here. I think maybe grab the cards out with the kids again. David is just doing a bit of editing. He is editing one of my running vlogs. You can hear the kids in the background just playing in the tent. I think they think <laughs> the walls are actually proper walls, but you can hear everything. <laughs> Hello! Yeah, there you go. You can hear absolutely everything. I'm enjoying the glass of wine, doing my nails while watching these two. I think, yeah. We've got the Harry Bow. Oh. Had the Harry bow, it's all gone. Got some biscuits, some chocolate. The kids have just had, just had some ice creams. Yeah, I think that's pretty much us for the evening. Um, it's quite calm now, it's, there's no rain. It's reasonably warm, it's just getting a little bit of a chill in the air. I'm in shorts, so it can't be that bad. Um, but I think it's the calm before the storm, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I think we're expecting a horrific storm tonight, um, which is not great. Um, and yeah, just... Awful UK weather for the summer. We're probably heading off to Swansea tomorrow, going to Denny's. So I will be definitely taking the camera with me. Are you laughing at? Oh, nice. And now we've got Red Panda, which you've met before. Biscuit. Eat Biscuit. He's a new member of the family. So I had a great day. Did you enjoy Polly Farm? Mm -hmm. It was a great farm. Absolutely great. Um, great farm, great zoo. Um, Theming was great throughout. That's how many greats have we just said there? What a drinking game. How many times does Diane say great? Um, the theming was. <laughs> Who's trumping? Is that Biscuit or Harry? <laughs> Biscuit! I've never heard a panda do that before. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> the joys of editing with children. Anyway, that no, was it, biscuit. Trails of biscuit. Yeah. <laughs> Hurry! Sorry! The toilets are over there! Yeah, anyway, Folly Farm was really good. Theming was great. It's nice to see that a British zoo stroke farm had that level of detail in there. Um, it's usually only um, saved for Disney and a couple of places, but yeah, we really enjoyed it. Much, much better than Blackpool Zoo that we went to. Um, in, well, even this February, was it last year? Yeah. Anyway, enough waffle. Um, I think that's us for tonight. Um, if, we film, if we do anything else, we'll film it, but I doubt it. So I will see you guys in the morning. <laughs>